Hi, in this video, we will cover using Oracle Data Guard to switch over to a standby database on an Exadata Cloud customer. In the demo, I will demonstrate how to perform a database switch over using Oracle Data Guard. Now, let's take a look. On your OCI console, open the navigation menu under the Oracle database, click Exadata Cloud Customer. VM clusters is selected by default. Choose your compartment and the list of VM clusters is displayed for the chosen compartment. Click the VM cluster that contains the primary database that you want to switch over. You can initiate the switch over operation by using data guard of the primary database. Now click the name of the primary database. Here we can see our primary database with the database unique name of HTAP PRD underscore DC1. Then under resources, click data guard association. Here we can see the associated standby database running on the peer VM cluster XSCC5-CLU4 with the database unique name of HTAP PRD underscore DC2. Now let's go back to the primary database to perform the switch over. For the data guard association on which you want to perform a switch over, under the resources, click data guard associations. Click the actions icon and then click switch over. In the switch over database dialog box, enter the database admin password and click switch over. You can monitor the progress of the data guard switch over process under the work request details page. Then wait until the switching over of your database has been successfully completed. Since the switch over has been completed, this database should now assume the role of the standby. And the previous standby should assume the role of the primary in the data guard association.